welcome to another breakfast session. I'm here with Babe Man and Maestro Flores. And I'm Imogene. How's it going? Good. How was your uh, How was your morning assembly today? Okay. You know, I heard you guys trying to get me to go up there to the yeah. little challenge where we have to put the hula hoop through like a line of people. Because you should have done it. Yeah. As I'm watching it, my back already gave out. It was like, nope. And like, I can hear like 10 cracks. Like, and I'm like, yeah, no. Gotta watch, I gotta watch myself at this ripe old age of what a, Why did it miss part? That, that's a her question. I, you can ask her. I had my own reasons. But yeah, anyway. That's the way that cookie crumbles. Did you get to do it? No. You always pick Judah and no. Penny. Yes, you do. Fair enough. Yeah. You picked them like four times. I asked Lucy and she gave me this giant like... So I was like, okay. And then I figured you never really step... All right, are you interested in one of those? Yes. Okay. I one. am too. And then and Belle was interested too, but she didn't get to do it. Hold on. We're, there's a pause in the show because we're getting uh, outside people telling me something. Is it important? Can you write it down on a whiteboard and then show it to me? There you go. So, I have a question. Shall we, Fabian? Uh-huh. Okay. All right. How are you doing, by the way? I'm tired. You look tired. Same. Mm -hmm. Okay, here we go. Let's do it. How about this? What is something you think about a lot in your life? Like, what My is some? Dog. Okay, there we My go. Let's cat. start with Fabian. So your pets, that's something you think about a lot? Yeah. Why is that? Because they're so It helps cute. if you turn your body towards... There you go. Okay, go ahead. They're so cute. They are, aren't they? What, you said you have cats? Yeah. I like cats-ish. Cats-ish. Meaning, I don't want them. I don't want to touch them. I have three cats. They're really lazy. I pretty much like them on a funny video where they fall or do something silly. Oh. And then I'm like, ah, cats. When I'm downstairs in the middle of the night and all I hear upstairs is my cats wrestling. Oh my gosh. You have cats too? At night. Three. My, I didn't know that. My one-year-old cat is like so smart. So my favorite bumper sticker that I saw on a car was like, why you know, you tell your cat, subject? tell your cat, I said, <laughs> it's like PS, 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 PS. Okay. I thought that was hilarious. My cat, my one-year-old cat is so smart. Uh, every time we get up from bed, he's like, oh, are you going to feed me? Are you going to feed me? <laughs> that's funny. How about you? What's something that's always on your mind? Um... My pets again. As well? You, you think yeah. about your pets too? Took you a while to answer also that question. Also my two dogs. And also, you you said a, like a word wrong with like a O. What do you mean? You said... Like, you you were like, that's phony. That's phony. You, you said... You didn't say funny. You said phony. Oh, that's phony. Yeah, that's how you said it. Like... I guess that's my accent. I don't know. Bounty. Yeah, yeah. That's funny. Howdy. I have no idea. Yeah, you said that. Like Maybe I was trying to do two things at once. Yes. And then the word phony came out. What does phony mean again? Phony means fake, right? Like, not real? I don't know. I don't know either. Why Actually, it, I do know. Why is it so quiet? It is very quiet. I mean, it's not really saying much. Are you sure you want to be on the show today? Okay. Just checking in. So something that's on my mind lately is lunch. Like since Mrs. Flores oh is God. on her uh, business trip, I am fending <gasps> for myself. When were you gonna tell us that? I know, right? You guys have to know all my ins and outs of my life. Mm -hmm. So now that's my biggest concern. I don't mind dinner and breakfast. I don't really eat. So mm -hmm. lunch, like that's the one that's on my mind. Do I have enough? Did I do anything? So, yeah. Anyway, let's try a different question. That was yeah. quite fast. Yeah. Um, ha -ha. Let's see. Is there anything about the world or people you want to understand? Yeah. That's a tough one. Is there My any? Mom. Yeah? Okay, why? 
Because she always yells at me for no reason. So you want to understand why? Yeah, because she's like, you're talking back. But then if I don't talk back, then she's going to get mad. <laughs> so I need to understand her. Fair enough. Okay, yeah. Sometimes in the moment we we go one way, but we're thinking another way. Yeah, as an adult, I can And then I she's making me get in trouble. Okay, <laughs> all right. How about you? My cat. You want to understand more of your cat? Why is that? Because every single night he looks outside and starts meowing like 10 times in a row. And then if you let him out, he wants to come back in? No, we don't let him out because it's nighttime. Oh. Does he go out during the day? No, we don't let our cats out because they won't trust anyone. Got it. A man of many words over here. But yeah. My cats have a whole jungle. <laughs> hmm. So what, let me see here. Let's try to, is there, oh, oh well, that was too fast. Slow down. Uh, oh, oh. Is there anything you're worried or stressed about? Let's My start cat. With, <laughs> think of something different other than your pets. What else is there that you think about or stress about? Not animals. Think of something else. Testing. Testing, yeah. Why is that? Because it's stressful. It is stressful, I agree. I think that in a perfect world, I would love never to have to give tests or anything. Um, because what you guys do throughout the year is a test enough, you know? I think that if you guys were able to show a year's worth of a growth, besides physical, to me that's a win. What do you think, Fabian? Do you think do you agree with that? Or do you like tests? I don't like tests. Yeah? So, unfortunately, the people who write our paychecks need proof that we're doing a good job. And I think that's what the tests are for. That's the long story short. Like, yeah. Yeah. But, um, what about you, Fabian? What's something that you're stressed about? I don't know. You don't know yet? Fair enough. That's um, a good one. That was a good question. What's up? Also, another one is when we have, like, our, like, rocket bath. I used to do a rocket bath. And sometimes, we don't really do it here, but sometimes, like, you time us on that. Yeah. And it just stresses me out. I'm that like, is stressful. And then I get a lot wrong because I'm going so fast. And, I, and I'm not thinking. What? I know something I'm stressful about. Ooh, go for it. Me eating, like, too much grease or pizza. Yeah, that's right. Because every single time I eat pizza, I, like, start to throw up. Really? That's not a good thing. I was going to say, I don't eat that greasy stuff too much either because I get little pimples and stuff back when I was a kid. So then I just stopped eating it. Now the only thing that makes me get the little things is too much chocolate, which is a good thing. That tells me that I need to cut back on sweets. You know? Okay. If there is something you're interested in learning... Last question. Is there, is there something you're interested in learning about in this class? Yeah. What is it? In other words, if we had another year together, right, as a class, same Maya. thing, same thing, everything, what would be something you'd want to learn about? How about that? Ooh, a little bit of silence on this one. What about you, Fabian? I don't know yet. Okay. More measurement, because I'm not very good at it. Cool, wow. I'm glad you went, like, like to an actual thing, not like, I want to learn about rocks. It's like, okay, fair I mean, not that it's a bad thing. Yeah, measurement. That's an important one, too, right? Because as you get older, you know, you want to build stuff or, or make something with food. All of that requires measurement, and actually, yeah, I agree with that. Also, I don't want to do type to learn. I want to do some basic cool learning on the computer, and you actually, somebody actually teaching you, because then every time you play that, you just start over. What if I were to tell you, instead of type to learn, I would give you guys each a typewriter to learn how to use? Yeah, you should do that. Right? At the end of the year. Sure, we could have just started it now. I just need to get everybody going. I have to teach the class how to use a typewriter, 
and that's a little tedious, so it, it takes time. So yeah. That should be our uh, one fun thing. Not like we've done a lot of fun things, but our one like. I have to agree with that. Yeah. I mean, I have to agree with that. We've done a lot of fun things, but another, I guess, another activity or project, right? Another big activity. Well, here's the way I'm thinking about it, Fabian. You tell me if you like this idea. Before I release those old machines on you guys, I was thinking of doing a, like a unit, like a like a teaching you guys what it is, how the history of them. Maybe somebody do a podcast segment, shameless plug. Yeah. And then once everybody's comfortable and they know how it works and where it's from, then they'll be able to start using them and I'll give you guys like a little license. I'll make a little license. So you have a typewriter license. We should do that. Right? I did it a couple of years back and it was a lot of fun. So that might be a thing. You're, you're giving me inspiration right now. Thank you, and Fabian. we should learn capybara language. That, I can only know two things I hear. Like, it's either we, 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 and then... Me and Lucy's language. I think it's like a more of a guinea pig. But I want to say they're just like guinea pigs. I want to learn like more science. Like what? Like... Did he just say mac and cheese? Science. The science of mac and cheese. Oh, we should uh, like interesting. The, like the not telescopes. Like but what makes mac and cheese? The, the telescopes. Cheese. This Let's is see me cutting many... you off because I want to listen to more mac and cheese. Tell me more about the science of mac and cheese. Like we should look close into stuff like like microscopes. Yeah. Mm. To see how many germs they have. Well, I don't know about the germ thing. Yeah. That whole comment about germs in the headphones. Not a fan. That was not a good thing to say. Now I'm scared of Right? And problems. that's, no, nah, that's, we, first of all, our bodies are full of bacteria, like all over our body. And it's healthy bacteria. It's a bacteria that helps us survive, right? If you don't have, if there was no bacteria in the world, our world would be gray. Can I just say something? There's actually a movie on this, and I might be spoiling it for you, but I don't think you guys care about it. The movie's called War of the Worlds. Ready? The War of the Worlds. And so the entire world is being attacked by these alien race, right? And this is from the 1950s. And they start destroying the entire planet, like just city by city, destroying it. And little by little, what they do is they, they take humans and they capture them inside this like organic y type thing, right? Like it's a living jail, put it that way. And there was no end, like there was, there was no positive thing. They were, we were losing, we were gonna lose until something happened. Little by little, the aliens started to die. Because Why? the germs. Exactly. The very germs that keep us alive were killing the aliens because they were not from our planet. So they didn't have the, the bright protection for that. Isn't that cool? Yeah. So it's the very things we don't like is that kind of helped us in that movie. I thought that was a really cool movie. Oh All right. Well, I think we... Um, I th- think that also uh, we should start learning more, go deeper into the podcast. Well, then if you come up with a reason how or what, then I'm in. I'm, I'm willing to learn, li- willing to listen. I'm going deeper into like talking about like interesting things at least because mm. we're like doing like fun things but what about like the interesting things really? like what give me an example like a typewriter like you were saying like the mechanics like, of a typewriter yeah. but how would that be good for hearing listeners that are hearing not seeing because also we could physically not physically but like ask like tell them to like draw it on something like, or we could also go into other stuff like how we do the podcast. That's a great idea. I think that we should do definitely do an episode on how we do what we do with a video. <gasps> yeah, that's what I was thinking. All right, I'm in. Okay. All right, I think we have to end it here. Yeah. Fabian, as always, thank you for joining. Sorry you weren't too chatty, Kathy, today. Hopefully your day gets better. It was so silent. It was silent. It, looks, it just felt like we were, it was just me and you. And he's just kind of like nodding his head every once in a while. And then the cats, too. I like the cat's comments. Oh, the cats. Cats are... Cats like at night, but then in the morning. All right. Bye, guys.